Hello, my fire signs, and welcome to my channel, Luminous Ascensions to Row. So I'm going to be doing a reading for my fire signs. So Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. We are going to look in, tap into the energy, and see what's going on with you guys. Please keep in mind to flip and switch the rows as needed. And gender is not important. The energy is. So I could say he, and it could be she. I could say she, it could be he. That's not important. The message is important. So just pay attention and be able to flip and switch as needed. Also, please only take what resonates. Don't force the situation. If you know stuff doesn't apply, it may not be your story, maybe somebody else's. So please don't force the situation. But we're going to tap into this fire energy for my Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Also, please take a moment to like, share, subscribe, and comment below if this does resonate. I would love to hear from you. Song on right now is Can't Raise the Man by K. Michelle. Ooh. You ain't never gonna change nobody. Ooh. Y'all already know that song. Coming home any time of night. Expecting you to let it ride. How many tears are you gonna cry? Oh, Lord. Sing it, Kay. All right. Or Kimberly, I should say. But, all right, let's tap in. Fire signs, fire signs. Let's tap in. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. What's currently going on with these fire signs, spirit? Spirit, guys, spirit, angels, ancestors to the highest bright light. I actually help me channel the energy needed to give clarity to my fire signs. Okay, so something's being rejected. And then this flipped over here. Fake friends. Ooh. So someone's rejecting some fake friends. <sighs> Someone also could be applying for a job or a loan. Something. And they could be getting rejected. I don't, I don't know. But I take this as somebody's rejecting some fake friends. Okay, spirit. What else for my fire signs? What do we have for my fire signs? Betray. Oh, God. Okay. At the bottom of the deck, kick to the curb. Oh, Lord. Child services. Running. Drama starter. Mm, someone's. Oh, man. Okay. So someone could be getting child services called on them. Someone could also be getting kicked out of a home. Or someone's running away from their children. Wow. Song right now on is LMA. Boot up. Oh gosh, it's my song. I love this song. But anyways. Uh, uh, Someone could be running away from a le uh, legal situation or they're scared. Or someone's running away from a drama starter that's trying to call child services on someone because they got kicked to the curb. Like, seriously? What is going on? Okay. So the cards that we got was betrayal in the struggle position. So someone could be trying to betray someone and it's probably not going to work. Or someone's in the process of planning a betrayal. Someone could be hiding a betrayal. Oh, shine. Your light irritates their demons. Okay, we have divorce, breaking contract, photo proof, getting evidence, and creative creativity muncher. Steal your ideas, copies your work, duplicates, feeds off you. Okay. So automatically someone's breaking a contract. Someone could be going through a divorce over some type of betrayal. Someone also could have tried to steal someone's work and it got rejected. Or someone could have... Okay, I'm also getting someone could have... Really? Really? Falsified some documentation or 
false signature. I don't know why I'm hearing that. There could have been friends involved in this or friends could have tried to set someone up for a betrayal. Maybe there was friends working with a partner to try to get photo proof on someone of a betrayal to try to force a divorce. It's like someone's seeing someone glow up and they're bothered by it. So all of a sudden there's some betrayal because you're not with these people anymore. Or you're not around these people anymore. Someone could be trying to get proof to break up a relationship, blackmail someone. Someone could be using some type of proof in a divorce case within a court situation. It's something to do with a betrayal. And it, it could be something to do with work too. Steals your idea, copies your work. You could have worked with this person. You could have worked with some friends that betrayed you. I guess we'll see. These three came out together, so I'll leave them together over here. So we're going to dig in and see what we get from here. Oh, Lord. I didn't even want to take this many, but Queen of Swords could be dealing with a, an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, the Tower, Scorpio, Aries energy. Some type of foundation came crashing down. And this could definitely be a, a legal situation, a court situation, or somebody setting boundaries with someone. And the foundation came crashing down. Someone could have found out someone was breadcrumbing them and giving to someone else at the same time. Six of Pentacles. Mm. Let's see. Slow Motion by Trey Songz is on right now. friends from my fire signs leo aries sagittarius leo aries sagittarius remember you can have these placements anywhere in your chart usually we say sun moon venus rising north node but i've learned especially in my transformation and my ascension that a lot of what resonates with my readings can be highly aspected in my chart even if it's not in my sun moon venus or rising but um yeah someone's leaving some fake friends Six of Swords. Someone's leaving fake friends behind. They feel some type of way about that. Or someone could just be moving away. Relocating. Yeah, the tower again at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Nine of Pentacles. So someone's single. Someone could be moving away from some fake friends that were trying to gain some type of financial come up off of someone. And someone started to notice that the only reason that these people were their friends were because of finances. So they're moving away from that. Someone may have to move because of financial struggles. Maybe they got rejected. Uh a home let's see clarify the six of swords and the nine of pentacles for me six of swords and the nine of pentacles okay yeah three of swords so some type of heartbreak Ten of Cups in the struggle position. Some, yeah, betrayal. Look, Ten of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Some type of betrayal. You could be seeing Ten Ten. So there's a cycle that's wrapped up. I feel like somebody here is heartbroken, whether it's you, your person, or a third party. 
It could be friends, family, ex-lovers. I don't know. But someone, there was a third party situation or someone was heartbroken because someone left a situation and they just wanted to be independent from the situation. They didn't want to no longer invest in it. They want to go towards their Ten of Cups. They're focusing on their Ten of Cups. But it came in the struggle position, so that's what I'm trying to figure out right now. So I feel like maybe someone... Oh, no. No, no. I don't want to say that. Okay, but I'm going to have to anyways. <sighs> someone could have found out... Okay, Under the Influences on by Chris Brown. Someone could have found out that... Yes. Okay, so that would... Someone could have found out about a friend sleeping with their person. And this person could have had a family with their partner. And it was this was part of the betrayal. They could have slept with a friend or someone in the family. Uh, and it was heartbreaking. And now someone has to move away. Someone has to leave. Someone has to become single and just focus on their own happiness because of this betrayal that left someone very sad five of cups yeah someone was lying and manipulating a situation seven of swords someone was definitely lying about a betrayal or a very deceitful manipulative something happened and somebody's like feeling very sad loss grief sorrow five of cups someone could have lost their family due to some fake friends Oh, wow. Okay. Let's see. Clarify this Three of Swords. What? What is this? Okay. All right. So the Temperance could be dealing with the Sagittarius. So something had to happen in divine timing. Someone needs to pour love into themselves. Someone could still be dealing with a heartbreak. Someone could still be in emotional turmoil. And they don't want to release it. But... There's something about needing to pour love into yourself. Maybe you were the type that you poured a lot of energy into friends and then you found out that they were fake. Especially if you got betrayed by a friend and they slept with your person. You thought that this person was your ten of cups and then you wound up getting your heart broken. Um, it doesn't have to be that way. It could literally be, you know, someone breaking free from a family situation that they were in to go towards this earth angel. They're, they're independent now. They're free. You could be seeing birds too. You've been seeing a lot of birds lately. But yeah, someone's moving away, especially from fake friends. So that's what I'm getting right. Yeah. Ten of pentacles, queen of wands. All right. So, what's rejected, spirit? Oh, that was great. Yep. <laughs> Four of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles could be dealing with a Capricorn or Taurus Virgo. But usually, the Queen of Pentacles is known for Capricorn. Um, someone's not interested in an offer. Four of Cups. They're refusing an offer. This could be you or your person. This could also be someone that was um, in a long-term commitment or a marriage. And maybe they stood in it for the finances. Someone could be coming to you that's a fake friend asking you for finances because you you could be this queen of pentacles. You could have a Taurus Virgo Capricorn in your chart Leo, you could have you could Leo, have tor this dog keep talking it. Keep you can sorry about that you can have uh earth in your chart so you could be this queen of pentacles you could be a business owner you can own your own business you could be an entrepreneur very loyal very caring You're very stable. 
and you're rejecting an offer or someone's rejecting an offer from a queen of pentacles someone could definitely be a fake friend coming to this queen of pentacles asking for money and you're not interested in helping people i don't know flipping switch what's the four of cups with the queen of pentacles please for my fire signs yeah the completion of a cycle a top the top there's something somebody's about to have a tower or someone already had a tower because this tower keeps popping up at the bottom but um yeah so the world someone could be traveling you could be world renowned you could be collaborating with someone for work someone can be asking to collaborate with you for work you're not interested I could be dealing with the libra because i see the scales here but i also feel like someone wants to like have an equal give and take in a situation yeah you could have to collaborate with people for work purposes you could have to be moving for work like traveling a lot be another state another city be on the go a lot getting work done collaborating with other people we got taurus leo scorpio aquarius here in the world Someone definitely could be traveling or moving towards this Queen of Pentacles to have an equal give and take opportunity. Maybe that you they rejected this person in the past and now they want to try to yeah, look, the Hierophant, Taurus energy. Someone could want I'm getting someone could be taking someone to court over finances or over some type of betrayal that was done especially if it has to do with a divorce so could be dealing with the taurus or you could have taurus in your chart someone could also be breaking free of the norms of society i'm getting that too like to to go accomplish what they want to go travel the world to go chase their dreams to do whatever they want they're breaking free of any contracts they're rejecting offers because they're going to go towards their happiness what they want to do so anything that they don't deem necessary in their life anymore it's being rejected it, friends family lovers everything i think i think what my fire signs are currently doing or have done or will be doing soon is breaking free from a lot of old contracts, karmic contracts, people, places, things that do not serve a purpose in your life anymore. Breaking free, closing cycles, releasing it, moving forward, focusing on stability, probably opening businesses, focusing on that coin, collaborating with work. Or just, you know, doing your own thing and people want to collaborate with you because they see you are being powerful. Especially if you are a spiritual leader or people look for guidance with you. You could have Taurus in your chart, Earth, Sagittarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, and of course fire because I'm doing fire signs. But yeah, clarify the world. Someone could be wrapping up an old cycle to go into a long-term commitment with someone or possibly a marriage. Or someone's wrapping up a marriage. They're not interested in it no more. Okay. Okay, so King of Wands. Okay, so this could be you, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. There we go, King of Wands. So, someone could be rejecting a King of Wands. Or this King of Wands is taking action. And rejecting anybody that gets in his way. 
he or she, remember, gender is not important. But yes, I'm also getting someone's breaking free from family. Like, someone they could have built a family with someone, they're breaking free from that. Or someone could be trying to come back in this King of Wands energy, offering something, and they're being rejected. It's not, that cycle is already closed. It's done. It's, yeah. This King of Wands wants something that's stable, something that's traditional, something that's long lasting, commitment, equal give and take, equal reciprocity. You could also be collaborating with your partner soon. I'm also getting that. Mm, we'll see. What do I need to know about this King of Wands? Justice. Could I have Libra in your chart? Or your person could have Libra? Page of Pentacles. You could be a tarot reader. You could do divination work. Or someone wants to come offer. Page of Pentacles. Someone wants to come give an offer. This person could be younger than you, does not have to be younger than you. But someone wants to come and balance the scales out. Or someone could be dealing with the legal situation, like I said, especially if there's a betrayal here. This could be with children also. Page of Pentacles could be a child. Someone, I'm also getting, someone could be watching. Okay, thank you, Spirit. Someone could be watching Tarot and finding out about a betrayal. And that's what's leading towards a divorce. Or separation from fake friends, people, family, everything. Because they want to balance their lives out. They want to close cycles out that do not serve a purpose anymore. So they're rejecting people left to right. They're closing out cycles because they're finding out about betrayals. It could be through Tarot. It could be through some type of photo proof. Some type of evidence that somebody got. And they're breaking contracts with people left to right. Even divorce. Yeah. All right. Clarify the trail for my fire signs. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. What's this betrayal? Oh, yeah. Someone's protecting themselves for real. So, Seven of Wands. You're you're divinely protected anyways. But, um, yeah, Spirit's saying if, if you are allowing these people still in your life that betrayed you, you need to protect your energy because they're going to keep doing the same things over and over. You're going to keep going through the same repetitive cycles. Especially if you wrap cycles up with people already. Leave it closed, close the door, keep it moving forward. But yeah, someone's definitely protecting their energy. They're not playing. You see how he's like, uh-uh, back up. I ain't got time. So, okay. Yeah, magic, yep. So, yeah, someone could have been, okay. You need to protect yourself from someone doing magic. It could be a Virgo or Gemini here, the magician. I'm also getting, please protect your manifestations. Do not go around telling people what you're doing, when you're doing it. Just come up. Just glow up in quiet. That's the best type of shine. The best type of shine you could do. Because your light will irritate the fuck out their demons. Definitely will. Because I feel like, especially with this card being here, Creative Muncher, be careful because if you're sharing your manifestation or your ideas or your projects or anything with people... They could try to betray you and steal your work or something, something. Especially if they see you coming up and you're glowing up and you becoming stable and you're free of the bullshit. They could be coming in to try to be like, oh, yeah, you know, we've been friends for forever. We're family. Da, 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 da. I got your back. Can you give me some money? <laughs> no. Or this person could have lied about you and said that no, what <sighs> lord people someone could have been lying about you i'm getting that very heavy too someone could have been lying saying that they rejected you they don't want to be your friend anymore but yet they're stalking you watching you work on your creative projects they're stalking your pictures after you broke contract with them i'm getting that too thank you spirit <laughs> Yeah, all these people. Could be a water sign, Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Or you could have this in your chart. 
Could be a mother figure also. Queen of Cups could be known as a mother figure as well. Doesn't have to be. But let's see. Clarify this betrayal with the Seven of Wands and the Magician Please Spirit. Yeah, focus on your manifestations. Protect your energy and focus on your manifestations. I'm telling you, holding on, someone's holding on. Someone's holding on. Someone could also be holding on to a betrayal. And they're using it against someone. I feel like someone's gathering evidence too to use it against someone in like a, a court matter. So they can hold on to someone financially. So they know that, okay, when I break free of this contract, I'm going I'm to take everything. You please protect your energy, people. Please protect your energy. Someone could have also found out that someone betrayed them by giving money to other people. Really? Why am I hearing that? The Worst is On by Janae Aiko. I really hope I say her name right. If I'm not, I'm sorry. I should have never let you in. Cause you got me face down. Don't take this personal. But you know worse. You know what you've done to me. Oh, this song is playing for a reason. What? I just can't keep running away. Okay. I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need you, but I want you. Oh, Lord. That's deep. Yeah, somebody's going through a transformation. Someone's ending something, and someone's heartbroken over it. Someone's losing sleep over it. Nine of Swords with the death card. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. Someone's going through a transformation. They're wrapping up old stuff, especially after betrayal. Someone found out about a betrayal. Someone's still trying to hold on to it and manifest a renewal, but someone's like, yeah, no, it's dead and gone. And someone's having sleepless nights about it. Someone could have had other options, too. Got the Seven of Cups here. Mm. Someone could have found out about someone's other options. <laughs> so you got the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. You got the King of Pentacles, so the Queen of Pentacles right here. So this could be your partner going through this. Maybe they were with someone else. Eight of Pentacles. There's a lot of Pentacles here. So there's like heavy earth energy right now. So you could be dealing with the earth sign for sure. Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But someone could be working on their stability. Someone could have betrayed someone with stability too. Someone could have betrayed someone with money. Uh, this person could have, you could have worked together with this person, collaborated on work together. And someone could have been stealing finances or holding on to finances without this King of Pentacles knowing. Or spirits telling you to hold on to your finances and continue to manifest. But be careful because there's people in the back trying to betray you. So you need to protect your energy. Especially if you are this king of pentacles. You could have earth in your chart very heavy. Or you could be an entrepreneur, a boss, boss daddy. Yes. Or a boss baby. Boss bitch. I like that better. Yes, boss bitch. Okay. But yeah, Eight of Pentacles, focus on your craft, focus on your work, focus on your stability. Stop focusing on a betrayal or, or something that hurts you. You have to release it and let it go. Everything happened for a reason. Who is this King of Pentacles? Four of Wands. You could have lived with this person, Four of Wands, or you could have, this person, wow, this person could be your twin. Oh, man. I mean, maybe you could have felt betrayed by your twin in the past. Or this was some type of family situation. Someone that built a family in a home. And they worked their ass off to build upon that home. But there was a betrayal within a home. It could have been within family. Or friends that you viewed as family. Why is the four of wands here? For the king of pentacles. 
You could have found out that this person was investing in someone else. Knight of Pentacles. Because they were moving so damn slow. It's like... It was so stagnant. It wasn't moving. Both of you wanted to invest in it. Or one of you wanted to invest in it. While the other was out here just... Betraying and... Playing. And probably fucking off on friends and stuff. And... Lord, this is... Wow. Okay. What is shine? Shine. Page of wands. Good news is coming in. You have good news coming in. This could also be a child involved or someone that acts childish. Or someone that's younger than you. What's this page of wands here for shine? Yeah, someone's coming in quick. Knight of swords. Who is this knight of swords with the page of wands? Okay, it could be a Leo, the sun. So this could be you coming in quickly towards someone or someone coming in quickly toward. This could definitely be a child involved. You got the sun here with the page of wands. And the sun, you see the little baby right there. Someone could be getting, okay, something could be getting illuminated, especially it says shine. Something could be coming to the light quickly about a child with a leo yeah that's gonna gonna erupt to some type of conflict about the truth and clarity five of wands this could definitely be family friends but someone feels burdened by this oh my god someone could oh man not this again i did something similar like this yesterday and i wasn't too happy about it but <sighs> I'm just going to say it very quickly just to because I have to say it because it's the type of reader I am. I'm definitely going to say whatever I feel or I see. Someone could have done a betrayal to a child. I don't want to get too tapped into that. If the cards come out and they say it, you know, okay. But I don't want to tap too much into that. But someone could have betrayed someone's family or someone's friend with a child. Someone could have had a friend with a child. I mean, someone could have had a child with a friend. I'm sorry. It's, it's, Excuse me. Yeah. Yeah. So someone could have been saying that they had a child with someone, but it turned out to be the friends or or it got illuminated that someone slept with a friend or some somebody did something to a child. I don't want to tap too much into that. So if it comes out, it comes out. But I'm just, I have to say what I see and what I feel. So it came out yesterday in the reading. So I know that the cards I see is for a reason. Okay. Clarify this sun with the Knight of Swords and the Page of... Okay. Nine of Cups. Someone could also be drinking a lot. Nine of Cups, I mean, Nine of Cups usually is like wish fulfillment, but when I, I don't know why, it just, someone could be drinking a lot, and this is getting illuminated to someone. Or it, I'm also getting, someone could be coming in very quickly to give you good news about something that was illuminated to them and they see you as their wish fulfillment they want to come towards you you could be this queen of wands aries leo sagittarius they could be taking action or you could be taking action on something that you see as uh your wish fulfillment your true happiness that could lead you towards the ten of pentacles or this queen of wands could be walking away from family yeah i'm also seeing that eight of cups Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Wands. This Queen of Wands could be taking action against her family to walk away. Or this Queen of Pentacles is walking away from something after it gets illuminated to go towards wish fulfillment and to go towards uh, true stability and, and happiness. Um, but I'm, uh, something with family, there's, uh, 
Yeah. Capricorn. Okay. What is this Ten of Pentacles with the Queen of Wands? Clarify that for me, please. The judgment in the reverse. Something that was unjust. Something, oh God, something's going to come out to the light that was not good. Mm -mm. Someone did something unjust to their family that broke up the family, the foundation. Or someone isn't giving any more chances to someone. Someone could definitely be going to court for sure. Could be taking family to court. Someone could be taking a Queen of Wands to court. King of Wands, we have I mean, we have the Queen of Wands to the King of Wands, the Queen of Pentacles to the King of Pentacles. There's a lot of people here too, so that's a little off. Or this is just counterparts. How many drinks is on by Miguel? See, I said somebody could be oh no. Also, please be careful with your drinks around people. Someone could be like, I'm getting that too. Someone could be trying to get someone drunk to betray them and get some type of photo proof to use against someone. Some type of fake friends could be involved. Oh, Lord. This is... you Okay. Okay. So, I'm going to get these three real quick and then I'm going to flip in here. Oh my goodness. So creative munch creative muncher, divorce breaking contract, and photo proof for my fire signs. What do we have? What do we have? Yeah, someone from your past. Six of cups. So someone from your past. You could have children with this person. Doesn't have to be. What else, spirit? For breaking contract, divorce, photo proof, creative muncher. Okay. Yeah, death. Something's completely done. It's over. Yep, because someone wants to go towards their divine love. Two of Cups. So someone is ending contract, breaking free from someone from their past to go towards their Two of Cups. So that's beautiful. Yeah, they could have been juggling you in the past, but yeah, that's done. That's dead. They're watching you very heavy, and they want to communicate with you. This person could be locked up right now. This is crazy because this looks like the same type of cards that I did yesterday. Someone could also be finding out about a pregnancy in court. Or someone could be taking someone to court after they found out about a pregnancy. Could be an Aquarius. The star, Empress, Taurus, Libra. Queen of Swords, air sign. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But someone could be trying to get someone locked up. There could be communication coming about this. Or someone is currently or will be locked up. And there will be some communication after some type of investigation is done. Oh, Lord. Okay. Oh, I don't like when I got to get in that energy. Okay. So, karmic tales. Because I see karmic all over here. This is definitely karmic energy. So, I got karmic tales. Okay. Let's see. Talk to me, spirit. Just a few, please. Snooping through emails. And that landed on top of betrayal. See, somebody's definitely looking for something. Someone's looking for evidence on somebody. Someone could have been looking through somebody's social media, I'm hearing, too. Like, someone could have had gotten access to someone's social media and found out about some type of betrayal. At the bottom of the deck, who are you? So, someone who's been wearing a mask for quite some time and maybe you're now just finding out so we got karmic so i mean apparently we all knew that this was karmic but you got party girl you got divine feminine magic night worker wow out of control and endings. And we got two more over here. 
marriage can they're not see marriage counseling so okay what i'm getting is someone could be breaking free from a marriage they've probably tried marriage counseling they tried it but then they realized that the person that they were married to could have been a karmic doing magic on them like sex magic glamour spells love spells all this nonsense and this person could have been snooping through emails and they found out or the divine feminine could have been the wife uh it could be divine feminine divine masculine remember gender is not important but it says divine feminine so maybe these people tried marriage counseling a few times uh maybe there was somebody found out about a betrayal with a party girl that was a night worker a stripper it could be a stripper you could be a stripper. Nope, nothing wrong with that. But somebody could be out of control. Some type of party girl could be out of control. And this person could be a night worker. You could, someone could have found out that their wife was a, a hoe. I don't like to say that, but you know. Gotta say what I see. A family man. Yeah. See? Okay, either... The man was done dirty in this situation. He found out that his wife was a, a night worker. He found out she was hoeing or she was out in these streets betraying while he was at home being a family man and working on the family. Or this family man could have been the karmic and wound up doing the betrayal. And this is what's causing the divorce. Because someone found something through emails or someone found probably text messages or on social media or something about some out of control behavior with a party girl or a stripper or just a hoe in general. And uh, yeah, this divine feminine is calling it quits. They, they probably tried marriage counseling, but it's still not working. So they're, they're on the road to calling it quits. Someone's just done with this situation, period. Um, let me get... Uh, let me get this real quick. And then I'm closing. Mm -mm -mm. Fire signs. What y'all done been through? I'm so sorry. If y'all already been through this, I'm so sorry. If y'all are currently going through this, even more sorry. If y'all are soon to go through this, please be aware. Please just... I mean, I don't know. I don't know what to say. This crazy. few from here spirit give me a few from here all right burning money someone exactly someone could have been oh my goodness no don't tell me <laughs> someone could have been paying a sex worker in that too because burning money oh. <sighs> mental prison just someone could be in a mental prison or someone could be in real prison self-love Someone's practicing self-love. That's beautiful. Best thing to do. Tenth health. This situation involves someone's ambition, their motives, their rank in society, achievements, and social class. Lust. Exactly. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. False twin flame. Ooh. You could have thought that... Okay. Fire signs, you could have thought that this person that you were married to or in a long-term commitment or had children with was your end-all, be-all. But this person was not. This person was not meant to stay in your life. False twin flame. This person could have just been in your life for a reason to teach you a lesson. Low-key, under the radar, not giving yourself away, being to yourself, not causing it to. Yeah. Someone's moving in silence. Hooked, addicted to something or someone. Oh, Lord. And that that was on top of night workers. So someone could have got, oh, Lord. Someone could be addicted to the strip club or the club in general. But I'm getting strip club. Because they were hooked on someone that they wanted really bad. Fake, fake, woo. fake flexing. Pretending to have money, material, wealth, putting on the front all for show. 
So someone could definitely be fake, fake. That's crazy. You got fake friends, got fake here, and then you got fake flexing. Like, what we... Mm. Mm -hmm. Give me a few more so I can wrap this to the spirit. Oh, my God. <laughs> Div Wait a minute. Wait a minute. On so yes. Thank you, spirit. Thank you for giving me that clarity of what I just said. You had to go through this to learn a lesson because guess where you're going now? To your divine union. You will be united with your partner. You and your partner will reunite. Yep. Thank you. Thank you, spirit. Love it. Soul contract and purpose. So this was a karmic contract. And you just had to wrap it up, close it up. You had to go through your life lessons. You had to learn what you would accept, what you won't accept, what you need to let go of, the betrayals, the hurt, everything that you're going through or have been through or will go through, it is for a reason. So just continue to move forward. It might hurt. It might be hard. But at the end of the day, just know these betrayals are leading you towards what your purpose and your soul contract, your real person, your divine union. This is where you're going. So don't let nothing stop you. Yeah, because these people are low vibes. Whoever... These people are as low vibrational. Like, you need to stay away from these low vibe people. Yeah, groupie. What I said? What I said? What I said, groupie. And you out here, what? Glowing up. Continue. Continue. Don't let none of these bad energy ass people get you down. Like, no. Goodbye. Dismissed. Toodaloo. Sayonara. Should I keep going? <laughs> okay. Anyways. So, let me get these last little bits and we're closing. So, sixth health. What someone does routinely, their responsibility, their skills, and their training, their employment. I mean, that could be the night worker or that could be someone needing to get their responsibilities in check and they order your queen bee. Go ahead, queen bee. Okay. Yes, bossing up, getting that bag, creating abundance and a legacy. That's what you need to focus on. That's what's priority. That's what needs to take place. Queen B or King B. Whatever. Queen or King. Do your thing. Get away from these groupies. Get away from these people that chase after you for money, friends, family, lovers, divorce. Oh my God. It's Whew. Cheater. Mm. Release yourself from whoever the hell this was like uh okay on that note this was your reading fire signs uh i hope it resonates if it does please remember to like share comment and subscribe to my channel i would love to hear from you all and just know you you're getting there baby you are getting there like don't let anybody stop you from your union your contract your purpose you're getting there keep pushing you're almost there. You're almost at the finish line. You had to go through all this to get there. But you know what? You still going to get there. While this person... Oh, Lord. The karma that is coming to this person is all I'm going to say. That's, I'm going to leave it at that. The karma that is coming to this person. So on that note, this was your reading. And I'm going to be wrapping this up. Next, I'm going to be doing the water signs. So Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So please be on the lookout for that as well and i hope you have a lovely morning afternoon or night wherever you may be god bless all of you and i will see you all again soon bye